the weather is perfect. I know. It was raining the other two days. Wait, what is that? What's that on my car? Hmm. Julie, go see what it is. Let's go on another adventure. Ooh! We like adventures. Let's go to the welcoming town where the horses began to do their famous walk. Welcoming? What, what's horses? What's this? Wartrace. Oh, yeah. That's, that's the, where the horses began. The, what, the pavilion? Yes. All right, let's go check it. Right. You ready? Yes, let's go. Did you know that Wartrace was founded in 1858? No, it is such a long time ago. So long. But it's also nicknamed the Cradle of the Walking Horse. So it's where oh. walking horses began. Cool, I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, hey, look. Cool. There's the clue. Awesome. You want to read it? Yeah, sure. What's it say? Welcome to Wartrace. Let's start with the actual place where it all began. Actual? Where it all began. Where would that be? I bet it's over there at the arenas. Oh, yeah. Oh, That's where they okay. show the horses. Let's go. Okay. So, cool fact about walking horse history. Wartrace started their horse show in 1906, so oh, it's wow. over a hundred years old. Pretty cool, right? Mm -hmm. Hey, look, there it is on the fence. What was once old became new again. I'm sure you can work out this clue. Work out? Where can you work out in Wartrace? New and old again. Well, they just refinish the gym. Oh, gym, workout. Basketball out. gym. Let's go. So really cool thing about this building is it used to be a barn where horses were and it, then they made it into a basketball gym. That's right. I actually played junior pro basketball. My whole family did. Yeah, that's right, you did. Mm -hmm. Oh, awesome. here's the envelope. Look, there it is. Mm -hmm. Something old turned into a rather haunted attraction. Haunted attraction? The old hotel? Oh yeah, that is really scary. Oh. Oh, should we go? Yeah, let's Okay, let's go. go. You know, I love history. This is so much fun. Yeah, I love learning about our small town's history. I do too. Oh, this place brings back memories. Daddy told me he used to stay here when it was a hotel. Really? And fun fact, the first ever champion for the walking horse, he's buried behind the building. It's on that sign. And it's also been lots of things. It's been a restaurant. It's been um, obviously a hotel. It's been a spooky place. In fact, it actually appeared on a national TV show because it's so haunted. Let's hurry up and find this envelope and get out of here. Yeah. Let's go. I see it. Let's hurry. You might be able to hear old train engines going by at this tail of one. Train? What's the t at the end of a train? Um, a caboose! Hey. Oh look! Caboose! The end of the train! There it is! This place contains history at its finest. History at its finest? The museum, Tennessee oh, Walking Horse History. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, let's hurry before another train comes through. You know fun fact about the Walking Horse Museum? What? Like musical chairs, it did musical locations. It started out in Shelbyville at the Calsonic Arena, now Cooper Stadium. Then it went into Lynchburg, and now it's here in the Bull Trace. So, oh, yay! Hey. Look, there it is. 
right, let's read this thing. People can eat here, but horses cannot. Hmm. Pizza! Oh, yeah. Iron horse! Let's go! You know, I bet the iron horse was a saloon. You know what? I bet you're right. Enjoy! Yes! Pizza! Let's go! Mission accomplished.